guys, it's your boy Tate, and I'm sure we all know the MacBook Pro with M1 Pro is a pretty amazing MacBook laptop, yeah? As a developer in Nigeria, here's my experience so far with the MacBook Pro, five months after its release. Since I started coding iOS apps on Mac, personally I don't think in the past five to six years Apple has ever got it right up until now. With the MacBook Pro with M1 Pro, the first thing that hits you is the bodywork on this machine clean and sweet the screen quality should amaze you it is so good it's got a fingerprint scanner with the power button amazing speakers that make me each time i use it Ugh. and with the m1 processor the speed is crazy no fan noises boots to your login screen in like seven to ten seconds or thereabout and yeah let's ignore the notch because <laughs> I really don't care about it. Ports on this Mac are three type C USB ports, one SD card slot. I don't know what that is there for, but whatever. One HDMI port and an airflow jack. The battery on this laptop lasts about six plus hours with moderate usage. Um, you can recharge this baby with the MagSafe or via the type C port with a mobile phone charge. Setting up my developer environment was a little challenging. This is because of the M1 Pro processor. Most apps are still new to it. But hey, they are workarounds, okay? You just need to do a little more work to get your way around it. So if you can get your way around this, I'm sure you have an amazing time with the Mac Pro M1 Pro. At least for the next three to five years. That's all for now, pips. So until next time, peace out.